Welcome back. I like this romance stuff. I'm digging it. So if you want to look really hot for your date night or special party, you know what? Joseph from Salon CTI, our good friend from Good Day Wisconsin, who does our makeovers, is going to show us some great, elegant, but easy looks. Take a look. Hello, Amy. I am here today to show you something very, very spectacular. I want to show you what is now being seen a lot in the Hollywood scene as far as ponytail. Um, as we know, ponytails have been around forever. They're very classic. But I want to give you kind of an update of what you're seeing right now, um, kind of overall. You know, and, and, and this is a good technique, easy to do at home. Um, I'm here with Tammy, and she's going to allow me to show you something really spectacular in the ponytail world. So, what I've done first is, let me explain, um, just to give this hair a little bit more body, um, I've taken some vertical curls by using a curling iron, and all I really did is you don't really have to spend a lot of time at this at all. It is also, it is not important for you to get all the ends in, okay? So I know those of you that are out there that are curling hair and bringing it to the ends and going, that's not what it's all about. It's about texture, it's about leaving some of the ends out, it's about little frothy pieces, so it's all about undone, okay? So what I've done first is take the iron, and all I did was wrap the hair around the iron like so, hold it with your fingers for just, oh, I don't know, maybe 10 seconds, and when you pull it out, what you're gonna end up with is all this beautiful curl that I've got going on right now, all this texture. Then, I'm gonna take a little bit of mist, and what this is good for is this is good to just give you an overall gloss, okay? This is actually a Pureology glossing mist. Love it. It's a, it's a very light uh, oil. So with that, I'm going to take my fingers now and just kind of run through this. Uh, we all know that uh, backcombing is important. And especially for those of you viewers out there that have fine to medium hair, you want to give yourself the set first so that you give yourself that body that you're looking at needing. If you don't do it, it'll be very flat to your head. So I'm gonna run my fingers through because I don't really want to brush out a lot of the, the wave that I put in. I really just want to have nice soft texture. Then we're gonna take a brush. Now this is a, a very, uh, what would I say, needed. If you're feeling like you want a little bit of height on top, the trick of this is we've all heard of back combing, but this is actually back brushing. Much, much easier, all right? You first of all would take a hairspray, and I've got Tolf here with me. Hi, Tolf. Uh, spray the hair a little first, and then you're gonna take the brush, and just take any round brush will do. And the reason I'm using a round brush is because if you don't have one of these at home now, well, you know, this was big like five years ago, and you got to have one of these round brushes for all the styling techniques that um, you need for today's style. So pull the hair forward and just roll the brush three inches down. Go in three inches, roll it, and push. And you can see that what I'm actually getting here is a bit of a cushion. And I'm going to put that right around the area that I want to give Tammy some height. So roll, roll, roll. And then I'll do one more over here so you can see. I'll take some spray. Spray at the base so the brush grabs. And take and watch. Three inches, roll, roll, roll. And now what you've got is that cushion. Now, when this comes over, you're actually not going to be brushing a lot of that that back brushing out, you're going to want to just very lightly finger over the top of that volume. See the volume that you get in there? It's wonderful. Now, what's very, very current is you're now going to swing with your fingers over to the side, okay? Bring it down, hold it here. Remember, the larger that your fingers are, the better that this is here to give you that puffiness that you're seeing a lot on the red carpets these days. So now I need a rubber band. So Tolf will give me a rubber band. We'll bring this off to the side very lightly. 
very, very lightly. I'm going to take a rubber band like this. Definitely something that you can do at home. You can actually not pull all of it through, okay? And you could leave it like this and pin it, which I think I'm going to do actually. So I have not pulled it all the way through. I need a bobby pin. What I'm going to do with the bobby pin is grasp the top and into the back brushing and push down and then bustle that up like so. Take this like this. And then the, the whole key factor here is to grab and pull so that you actually get this very, uh, very elegantly kind of little house on the prairie, rough texture. And what you're left with, a little hairspray, is this really neat, fantastic, $200 looking hairstyle that you have done at home in five minutes. Wasn't that cool? Cool. All right, Amy, check it out. It's beautiful. There it is, the new ponytail for today. All right?